Hello everyone, welcome to Ilha and the Magic Box. Today on our show, we are going to have Fontes Bontalis. Fontes Bontalis is from Greece, but he lives in London. Let's see what he's going to say. Enjoy the interview. Hello. Hello, I can hear you now. I can hear you as well. How are you, Fontes? Very, 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 very... I have a few more very basic. <laughs> good one, good one. Uh, okay, folks, so welcome to William and the Magic Box. So I've got here this Magic Box full of random fun questions, okay? Are you ready? Yes. Let's do it, let's do it. Ready for the first question? Wow, okay, let's go for the first one. Let's do it. Um, Raul, let's start with a, a, a challenge one. Um, what makes you the saddest? I would say the most is hypocrisy. Uh, uh, things not be done the way they should be. It's not specifically my way, I don't care about my way, but if they don't happen in the correct way, that makes me sad. And also to focus. Right, I agree with you. I think that makes um, people sad, even if I procreate. Shall we get another one? Yes, please. Let's do it. With Tell me, what, what's your idea of the perfect day? Uh, yes, it should be coffee and cinema, or to cinema. Uh, yes, that's my idea of day. Um, let's get another one, folks. Let's do it. Next question. Let's start. Yeah. Let's do it. Um, what is the most romantic thing someone ever done to you? I'm trying to say, I have a couple of things. One is very like silly. The other one is good. Um, the silly one is that my first ex from Greece. When uh -huh. I finished work, I came home and I was like, I had the full box of. Um, uh, hot wings of KFC, and I was like, yes, I don't need to cook, but can destroy the box. It's literally when I drop in the house, like literally left, like a few minutes ago, I was like, yes, that was like the most romantic thing. So I mean, oh. like, especially fast food. Uh, second romantic thing, um, as I say to you, cinema, uh -huh. and I do like, you know, holding hands. Oh, that's cute, that's very cute. <laughs> uh, let's get another question. Ready? Right, let's get another question for folks from Athens. What did you think was the most challenged part of being a kid? Okay, I come from a different back background than the UK people. So, being, because I'm gay, being gay in the 90s in Greece is not the best thing. We didn't have the section 28, mm -hmm. but for me to, you know, to be at school and be like openly, because you can see the voice, you can see the mannerism, I will never be able to hide that I'm gay. Um, <laughs> and I was always being pulled, especially in, um, primary school. Right. The first three years of high school, the junior high school, yes, I was bullied as well, but then the last three years of the um, advanced high school, it just, everybody stopped thinking about that. Probably all the boys started having girlfriends, so they wouldn't even bother to bully me. Of course. Um, <laughs> but then it stops. But yes, I had quite some difficult time. Uh, so anytime I was having quite a bullying at school, my mom was being like Alexis from Dynasty, 
visiting the school, sitting next to the teachers in the teachers' room, and she like, "Hello, I just came to have a coffee with you until we sort out the issue with my son. I'm not going to leave until the until the day. I'm going to come tomorrow if, if it's still an issue, but I will come to stay with you for the day." That's amazing. That's but for me. She was coming all the time to school when I was coming in. She was like, I'm going to stay and then the issue will be resolved. I'm going to have coffee with you, lunch with you. That's amazing. All the breaks together. But yes, um, it was a situation, like I said to you, in the last three years of uh, high school, they were like, no, 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 don't, 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 it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Don't, shut up. don't say to your mother to come back tomorrow, please. Really? That's yes. amazing. There's That's... no policy you have to keep you out. So my mom was like, okay, there's an issue, I'm gonna sit here until the issue will be resolved. Sit down great. with your chair, with a big heart, and she was like, I'm waiting. Like looking glamorous, very glamorous. Alexis <laughs> from Dynasty, please. Yeah. That was what she's coming for. So I was like, yes, we've got it. Great. 99% it was resolved, 99%. Amazing, I like your mom already. Right? Shall we go another one? Shall we do it? Please. Ready for another one? What is? Please. Let's do it. Um, what's your favorite TV show? All time Golden Girls. Okay. Like it's watch a classic. it. Classic. Everyone loves that. Um, if we go to the children's TV show, I would say Sailor Moon and Digimon. If you had okay. those things. Um, if we go at this period, I'm like, I would say Once Upon a Time, but I uh -huh. haven't seen the last season. So that's the most yeah. favorite things I can imagine. Right, let's get another question. Let's do it, folks. <laughs> right, next question. What makes you the happiest person? <sighs> okay, there's a phrase that says that they used all the time, and that's come from a cartoon uh, as well. Uh, it says, uh, happiness isn't something that you search for, but something that you owe. That's totally true. Ooh. Let's get another question. Right. Are you enjoying this, the show so far, folks? Oh, yes, 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 I do. Sorry, I'm not dancing like crazy because uh, <laughs> it, it, it's just my lunch time, basically. So uh, after we finish, I will probably have to grab the food. Uh, but this is basically my Don't lunch. worry, I'll do the dancing for you. That's okay. Brilliant. <laughs> All right. What is the strangest gift you have ever received? Uh, someone got to me a lollipop in the shape of a tennis. Ooh. In a spoon, in a spoon. Of course. So I'm excited, but I don't need it because I have loads of lollipops. <laughs> but this one was a, a present one, so it was a special, it was a present. And it was a work present from a work company. Oh my lord, did you did you enjoy it? I mean, uh, yes, because afterwards oh. we probably, I, if I remember, we probably got drunk and I was starting. <laughs> So, yes, <laughs> yes, everybody enjoyed it because after a few drinks, I'm like, uh, in another <laughs> universe. So, um, I was like, yes, yeah, yeah, I'm enjoying it, I'm loving it, that's fine. <laughs> Let's do another question, let's do it. Next question. What bad habits do you wish you could stop? Eating the... fast food all the time. Oh, really? Eating pizza in the oven all the time. <laughs> Eating ice cream all the time. <laughs> uh... I right, said to get another question, let's do it.
Right, another question for you, I think it's gonna be easy to answer. Um, what, what's one movie you could watch over and over again? Devil Wears Prada. Oh, that's all. <laughs> I love it, I love that movie. I love and I'm that. always the first Emily from that. I'm yes. the first Emily. My, one of my bosses is like me, so I call him the Emily. And then he's calling me Emily. So I'm what? always what? the first Emily, I'm not Andrea. I'm always the first Emily. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get another question. Let's do it. Try focus. Let's get another question. Um, what makes you most uncomfortable about dating? And what it finds me weird and uncomfortable is like people they. So I'm trying to create a conversation and it doesn't yeah. go well. It just go nowhere. Or the answer is like monolectic, yes, no. Right, folks. Um, I've got three questions left for you. Okay, let's do another question. Right, let's get another question. What motivates you most in life? Ambition. Good, very good one. It's like, because I'm a workaholic person. I like to get lots of things to do. Me I too. get to be, I can see that. Uh, right, I've got two questions left. Let's do it. Great. Ready? Mm -hmm. um, what was the biggest punishment have you ever received? Oh, that I have to pay for my army because of the UN. They charged me 6,000 euros. <gasps> really? Yes. I'm not going to go anywhere, so I'm happy to pay it, but I'm still paying installments. So when I oh. finish completely, then I finish with it. But yes, oh. um, that's the normal English anyway. <laughs> right, folks. Ready for the last one? Please. Let's do it. Let's do it. Last question. Last but not least, as they say in the driveway. Absolutely. Um, how would your best friend describe yourself? Workaholic, annoying, uh, ultra, ultra, very ultra. When I get drunk, I get a little bit more slutty. Uh, sometimes childish, but I think I've surpassed this level. I think so. Uh, workaholic. Right, uh, Fox, it's not the end yet, okay? What I'm, what's going to happen now? I'm going to give away some words. It is just tell me one thing, the first thing that comes to your mind, okay? Cool, let's, let's do that. Start. Let's start with love. Hearts, bubbles. Okay. Thanks. Money. Uh, Abba song. Money, money, money. Good word. Sex. Which position? <laughs> Good to know. Family. Uh, mm. My grandma has taken over everything, so she's ruling the universe. Oh. I love that. That's good, that's good. Politics. <sighs> okay. Want and don't want to know. Okay. Religion. I used to love to know, but now I don't care. I don't want to know. I don't want to care. Religion. Next subject, because I'm atheist. <laughs> Okay, a fear. Fear, oh, um, horror movies, which I love them anyway. And okay. um, personally, uh, you shouldn't be fear of anything. True, so. I agree with you. A desire? To get the promotion. Good one, uh, amazing. A regret? 
Um, so regrets, yes. I sent an email, I said something to someone, and I said, hmm, um, I should have sent something. Or oh, on the email, I should have added this thing, for example. And I'm like, I'm overthinking and I'm regretting. How about friendship? Many friends, and I'm actually at the happiest place in this world. Um, a wish? Weird, but at some point I would wish to have my own my own children. To have children. Right. Um, but let's pretend now I'm going to have a coffee with your lovely mom. Your lovely mom, I'm going to have a coffee with her. Tell me, in one word, describe in one positive word, Fotis, and one negative word. What do you think your mom, Sofia, would tell me? Just oh, one just word. Oh my goodness, I love you so much. Oh my goodness, with my favorite toy in the world. It's actually a joke because the is a comics of Polar Cash. It says, um, it's, a, it's an actual scene, it's a headdress, and the mom says, Oh, I can't understand why my two boys are fighting all the time. I love both of them, and Fotis, and the other one. <laughs> without naming the other one. So, yes, um, my mom's a wish child show, but that. So, the bad things she would say is that, ah, oh, but this doesn't have so much time to talk to me. She doesn't talk mm. to me four times a day. <laughs> talks to me every, every day or every second day, once. Oh. I want to talk to me every day for three, four, five, six oh. times. That's that sweet. what my mom would say. That's sweet, very sweet. Right, folks, start, just now let's play Fotis and the Magic Box and you can ask me a question, okay? But I'll say that. What is the benefit of this video as well as and mm -hmm. how that will help with your background and the work that you do, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Sure. And uh, sure. this idea came to my mind about like a a, a channel about questions, asking questions that I'm doing right now. Um, this project, for example, they're not right or wrong answer. I think everyone has a different point of view and, uh, and the, whole, the main thing of the channel is to bring a positive thing. People that have their experience of life as your whole idea. And I just hope you enjoyed the experience. I hope you liked it. Thanks for your time. Oh, just tell me a positive quote or something beautiful that inspires you. But for both of us, keep going, that's all. But I Good. keep going, I keep going. I have so many things to do, but I'm happy with that. And I keep going, keep going, Great. Keep going. Because as much as you, you can, do, do, do. Like, Never stop. The video. Thank you very much, okay? Thanks for your time and enjoy your day. Okay, it thanks for- It was a pleasure, bye-bye. Bye. Hello, did you like the interview? Thank you very much. Thank you so much for being part of this big project as well. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, William and the Magic Box, and see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.